Hey everyone, we're going to explain why the following are not groups. And basically, uh, we just have four criterion, and you only have to show one criterion to show that it's not a group. So, for example, for the set of odd integers under multiplication. So, we're talking about odd integers. But under multiplication, the inverse um, for this, the inverse of A equals... Uh, a inverse which equals 1 over a but 1 over a is not a member of the integers so it's not closed okay for 2 uh, the complex number under multiplication so for the complex number under multiplication um, there's 0 belongs to the complex numbers but 0 has no inverse. So that's why that's not. Um, three, the natural numbers under addition. So basically, for um, the natural numbers, there's no inverse. So the inverse of A um, is uh, A to the negative 1, or in our case, the inverse of A would be, let's write it this way, negative A. But negative A does not belong to, um, should not belong, uh, does not belong to the natural numbers. All right, and for um, the set of all subsets, Um, a, B, C, D under the universal set take away C. So if you have that uh, the universal set take away C, so that means C is not there. That means our identity is the empty set. So in the universal set, you have an empty set, but there's no inverse possible. And that's it. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.